In this video, we are going to create this animation in PowerPoint to reveal any text we want during our presentations with one click. Let's get started. Hello guys, welcome to idea number 4 in this video series. Today's video will be short, as the idea we are sharing today is simple, but don't get me wrong, because this idea is very useful to reveal titles during your presentations. I hope you are really enjoying these text reveal videos, if so, please like and consider subscribing to my channel, it will be a pleasure to have you on board. Ok, so no more talking, let's get this done. As always, here is our brand new presentation, so let's start by removing the default content and adding a beautiful rectangle as we always do. Let's now add some dummy text that will represent our title. As usual, I will change the font size and the font type. Now, while having the text selected, click on the rectangle, go to Arrange, Align, Align Middle. Now, let's add a second rectangle that will help us to hide our text. Once you are happy with the size, use the left arrow key on your keyboard to move it like this. Ok, great. Right click, send to back. Now click on the first rectangle, change the color and remove the outline. In fact, we have to do the same with this one. However, this one will be white, so our audience cannot see it. Awesome, now let's group these two rectangles. And now it's time to add some animations, so go to Animations, Add Animation, Motion Paths, Lines, and let's change the direction to the right. We need one more line animation, so go to Motion Paths once again, and select Lines. Now look at this. Grab this green bubble and move it to the red arrow of the first animation. Next. Grab the red bubble of the second animation and move it to the green arrow of the first animation. By doing this, our second animation will start from the point where the first animation ends. Now open the animation pane, click on this group and let's go to more entrance effects to add a stretch animation. Hit OK and let's go to effect options to change the direction to from bottom. Hit OK. And next we are going to move the stretch animation to the top. And let's change the start of these two animations to After Previews. Now we are going to add an animation for the text. So click on it and click on Appear. Change the start to After Previews and let's move it here so the text shows up once the first line animation for the rectangles has finished. We need to send this text to back and now let's take a look. Perfect! Now, in case you want the rectangles to move faster, just click on their animations and change the duration to 1 second for example. And there you have it! So that's all for now guys, thank you for watching, don't forget to subscribe, hit the bell icon to get a notification whenever I submit a new video, take care, and see you next time!